8-year-old Jerrine Manuel starts her Christmas break today on a happy note. Her wish this year was granted. She is able to continue going to school even after a fire burned down their shanty. Masaya na po kasi po nakatulong sa amin yung mga tao. Tsaka po sila mama rin po, binibigyan na rin po sila ng mga blessings. Tsaka si papa rin po sa kanyang pagtatrabaho sa amin, nakatulong din po siya sa amin sa pag-aaral. Every month, Jairene receives 300 pesos as a beneficiary of the Conditional Cash Transfer, or CCT, the government's main poverty reduction program. The money was used to replace her uniforms, shoes, and books, all turned into ashes by the fire. But neither disaster nor poverty will stop Jairene from continuing her education. Kasi po, kapag umabsent po ako ng umabsent, nawawala na rin po ako sa attendance namin. Tsaka, ayoko na rin po umabsent dahil gusto ko na pong matuto ng maayos sa pag-aaral. Jairene is a success story for the CCT, also known as the Pantawid Pamilyang Pilipino Program. Her family complies with the conditions on education and health set by the Department of Social Work and Development, the implementing agency. Pantawid Pamilya, we're addressing two gaps of education, quote-unquote. One is to ensure that the children finish primary schooling and are kept healthy uh, because keeping them healthy will make them, uh, will provide the ability for them to be competitive later. According to the DSWD, because of CCT, more children are staying in school with better chances of graduating from grade school. The CCT families are also spending more on education and health. DSWD says the total number of households getting assistance from CCT reaches more than 3 million. But according to a Commission on Audit report, the CCT left out 1.8 million poor families sowing envy and disunity in poor communities. One of Jairin's neighbors, Rhea, claims she is not envious, but says her family needs assistance too. Opo, kasi hindi naman ano eh, hindi naman, syempre, kumakain din naman po kami ng, ng kinakain nila, di ba? Kaya dapat talaga lahat. Misan yan, hindi na kami nag-aano, hindi na kami nag-aalmosal, ang gising na namin, tangalian para tipid, di ba? Ganun talaga, pag nag, nagpapaka-practical ka, kailangan gising ka. Gising tayo alas 11 para tanghalian na. Huwag tayo kinagabi, ano, hapunan mo na susunod. The DSWD says it is expanding the program to include other deserving families. Since her family has become a beneficiary of the CCT program of the government, Jairene has become more excited to attend her classes every day. She says she wants to become a doctor someday because she wants to help sick kids in her neighborhood. Kids who are not as happy and as lucky as she is because they feel neglected by the government. Voltaire Tupas, a Rappler, Manila.